Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina. If you are new here, here on my channel, I do bookish related things and I also do beauty. So if that sounds like something you'd like to be a part of, I say please subscribe here to my YouTube channel. And if you do like this video by the end of it, I say please give it a big thumbs up. So as you can tell today and also by the title, I am doing a beauty look and not just any beauty look. I'm giving you guys a holiday inspired makeup look, something that you can recreate and wear for any holiday. It doesn't have to be Christmas, but since Christmas is literally a couple days away from us, you can definitely spice up your look with a little glam. And I kind of went towards purples and rose golds um, instead of your traditional golds and reds but stay tuned because i do have a couple other videos that i want to create for the new year so i definitely will be hopping on that tradition train and giving you guys a more traditional look that everybody loves to go for around the holiday season happy holidays you guys and i hope you guys have a merry christmas and yeah we're gonna go ahead and jump into the video Alright you guys, so starting with my Naked 3 by Urban Decay palette, we're going to grab this white shade and we're going to begin placing this all over the lid area. This is going to set down that concealer we laid down. Going in with this pale pink shade, I'm going to begin placing this all in the crease area. This is going to be the first transition shade. by Jaclyn Hill palette and I'm going to grab this other taupey pink shade and I'm going to place this in the crease area as well. And then going in with this berry shade, I'm going to further deepen things up and placing this all in the crease area. I'm going to start cutting my crease with my concealer. And then I'm going to go in with this elf, elf glitter and place this all over my lid. This is like a rose gold glitter. Going in with this rose gold pinky shade to further sparkle this look out. And then going back into my Naked 3 palette, we're going to grab this very deep purple shade and we're going to place this on the outer V area and then slowly work our way into the crease area. Going 
going back into that pinky rose gold shade and I'm going to clean up where the black purple has been on my lid. Going in with this e.l.f. silver shade, I'm going to place a very little bit on the back of my hand and tap it on my eyelid to further sparkle, sparkle this look up. <laughs> going in with this black liner, we're going to go ahead and wing it out. Going back in with that deep purple shade and I'm going to further deepen out the outer V area. Using my Maybelline Fit Me foundation. my Catrice concealer and I'm gonna place this underneath my eyes down the bridge of my nose on my forehead and also on my chin going in with my fit me pressed powder to set my face and then also my translucent powder to sit underneath my eyes. I'm going to begin contouring my face using my Lula bronzer. And then going in with this ColourPop Super Shock Shadow, I'm going to use this to highlight my inner corner underneath my brow bone. And I'm also going to be using this to highlight my cheekbones. Going in with my e.l.f. blush and we're going to start putting some color back into these cheeks. Going back into that berry shade and I'm going to place this on the lower lash line. And then grabbing that purple shade again and topping it off with that berry shade. Lash time. Going in with this new pink lip liner by Milani. Nude Shade by e.l.f. And then topping it off with any clear lip gloss. Setting my face with my NYX setting spray. 